for your days are belonging to us. I used to be an adventurer like you. Uh, excuse us, Mr. Logan. Mother of God. Hey guys, King of Persia back with a video on my thoughts on an article I read not too long ago. By the way, let me start off by saying I'm wearing my Portal shirt, as you can see, um, in celebration for Counter-Strike Source being released on Linux. Today is the 8th, uh, three days ago. So, just, just a little thing, because I'm a big Val fanboy. So, yeah. Anyway, I read an article saying that the developers of Fallout New Vegas, Obsidian Entertainment, have uh, been pitching the idea of a Star Wars RPG to uh, LucasArts. They pitched the idea of it to LucasArts, um, and uh, sorry, and they have said that they got a positive feedback from LucasArts saying about the Star Wars RPG. They got it back. They got the response back the very next, the very same day that they pitched it. So that's good. That's definitely good. Um, they're going to be pitching it to Disney in. Um, uh, in the future, sometime in the future, kind of when the dust settles, and uh, I'm going to link you guys to the article in the description. And uh, but overall, they said that they're going to pitch it to Disney and try to get their praise as well. I think it's I think it'd be a pretty cool idea. It'd be interesting to see another Star Wars RPG. Now, here are my thoughts on it, because that's the part of this video. Is my thoughts. Um, first off. Right off the bat, they should not make it like they did with New Vegas. New Vegas was a good game. My favorite Fallout game. I liked it better than Fallout 3. Um, I didn't really like Fallout 3 that much. But it should definitely not be like New Vegas. It shouldn't use the same engine. I don't even know if it should be first person. Uh, because the combat, like, like the melee combat, like Star Wars is known for those beautiful, epic battles like space battles, lightsaber battles, gun battles, all that stuff, that wouldn't work with the type of um, engine that New Vegas used. Really, I think, like, just to, to swipe across the screen, like uh, like Skyrim and stuff, or the melee weapons in Fallout, that would not fare well with lightsaber battles. If if you do play a Jedi, a lightsaber-wielding character, in this Star Wars RPG, once again, it's just being pitched. They have no concrete ideas yet. I don't think they do. But it's just being pitched. But my thoughts are this. Don't make it a first person game. First persons, there's not many Star Wars first person games that worked. Except for like Jedi Outcast. Now one strength that Obsidian has in this situation is that they developed the sequel to Knights of the Old Republic. Knights of the Old Republic 2, The Sith Lords. Which was, um, Knights of the Old Republic 1 was made by Bioware. And, uh, they gave, uh, Pretty sure they gave the rights over to Obsidian and they made the sequel. So, Star so Obsidian has experience pretty much making the same idea, a Star Wars RPG. Now they said that the story, if they were to do the game, would take place between Episode 3 and 4, where all the Jedi are being exterminated, it's a time of change and all that, the Empire is rising up, and, um, but, I mean, the way they, the way they talked about the story between 3 and 4, they kind of implied that you would be a Jedi. One thing I think that would be interesting is if Disney or LucasArts would have some type of involvement in, in, a, in a Star Wars RPG, because I think it would be really interesting to see what they do with it after the, after the acquisition of LucasArts from Disney. That would probably piss people off, piss a couple people off, because, you know, just Disney having involvement in Star Wars, they don't like that. But I think it would be interesting, because it would, it would show, it, would, it might show what Disney has in mind for Star Wars. I mean, they might try to they might try to uh, bring some of the ideas they have for the next movie for episode seven into this game. And I think that'd be interesting to see. So that is it. Um, that, those are my thoughts on the Star Wars RPG that is being pitched by Obsidian. So don't forget to uh, like this video, like my Facebook, and subscribe. And if you want to be friends with me on Steam, my Steam name is the same as my YouTube name. And thank you for watching.